In Somalia, as many African countries, we discuss solutions and negotiate settlements for our problems under a tree. Sitting here today with my brothers and sisters from different parts of the continent and the town of Foreign Simple of Baobab Tree assures me of the endurance of that spirit. As we mark 10th anniversary of the esteemed forum, I would like to congratulate and commend its organizers for staying true to that spirit and maintaining a significant platform that engenders frank discussions to explore African solutions to Africa, Africa's most pressing problems. Your Excellencies, we have seen in Somalia that says, which translates to peace is the bed on which men can only can interest. Our continent is con contending with unprecedented threats that impact our that that impacts the survival of our people, our landscapes, and uh, very existence of our nations. We can spend hours listening to these threats and analyzing their causes and effects. However, I believe in our in a, I believe to build in order to build resilience, resilience in our respective nations and in our continent as a whole, we must contend with two significant factors that could have the biggest impact in addressing any threat, connectivity and people. Ladies and gentlemen, in the one hand, an ever more connected world is bringing unconventional global challenges closer to our doorsteps, exposing our weaknesses and amplifying our fragilities. On the other hand, the lack of connectivity in our continent and in many, in, in, in many cases within our nations as well is hindering our ability to pool our resource in and the individual advantages to respond to challenges adequately and collectively. The absence of adequate infrastructure and the inability to access basic services and economic opportunities only leads to exclusion, fuel uh, conflicts and threatens peace and stability. And as the COVID-19 pandemic demonstrated, infrastructure connectivity can play a significant role in preventing emergencies from becoming endemic. Therefore, we must underscore the importance of the connectivity in realizing our aspiration for sustainable peace and security. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, here in our rich continent, the most significant asset we own is our people. Yet, climate change is posing ex existential risks to every living being, driving food insecurity, igniting dangerous conflicts and causing mass displacement. Each day, our communities struggle to adapt to this extraordinary challenge, they are yet again facing with other threats that, as, that such as terrorism, radicalization, and violent extremism. In our experience, the only way to withstand such a challenge is to involve the people who are, at the end of the day, the ones with the real power to bring about lasting and a fundamental change. In Somalia, for example, the failure of four consecutive rainy seasons has caused one of the most severe droughts in living memory. It is impact on the people, however, has been exacerbated by the deliberate inhuman acts of the terrorist group Al-Shabaab. 
by isolating communities, cutting off main, main supply of foods, bringing, burning wells, and destroying crops. Al-Shabaab have directly and deliberately contributed to the worsening of the entire humanitarian situation in my country. And when people had enough, they rose up to expel this cancer from their midst. Dulmidi, the rejection of any form of, of oppression, the name given to the current and the ongoing offensive against the Shabab and the similar terrorist groups in Somalia. It takes root in our new comprehensive strategy to liberate people, their territories, properties, and months from creeps of violent extremism. The core component of this strategy is our people. My brothers and sisters, our administration envisions a Somalia at peace, a Somalia at peace with itself and at peace with the rest of the world. And as we measure cohesion within our societies through reconciliation and the political settlements, we also prioritize peace and security. Hence, as soon as we took office, we denounced the strategy of containment and announced a comprehensive offensive against terrorism in Somalia. Taking the fight, taking the fight to them ideologically, financially, and operationally. To cleanse the minds of misguided people, we mobilize religious scholars to challenge the malicious misinterpretation of Islam. To curb their fundraising capacity, we directly targeted their extortion networks and the infrastructure and implemented strict mitigation measures. And as we launch our operational campaign, local communities organized themselves as at a grassroots level took up armies and uh, with the help of our SNA force liberated their towns and villages. We may have lost many heroes in this process, but in the past three months only, terrorists have been eradicated from an area covering 150 kilometers in central and southern Somalia. A significant victory worth celebrating. Dulmidid <laughs> is at its earliest stage. However, its success so far can serve as a proof of concept for a model of promoting peace and security through the effective engagement, empowerment, and mobilizing of local communities. It would be great to see this model replicated everywhere innocent people are suffering at the hands of the ruthless gangs attributing misguided nations to religious ideologies in order to oppress and enslave communities. Our people are the key to attaining this peace, stability, and prosperity we aspire to. Our role as their leaders is to provide them with support and instill a positive shift in their mindsets that will encourage them to take constructive actions. In conclusion, please accept my gratitude for the my sincere gratitude for the opportunity to share my thoughts in this unique platform. Kafarhi, el kagas habta da yokaraba dava. Ulesu dig abka da hab shield, si at si fudu lago gudurto. Marka adlesu dig to application kata hab shield, er laka de reso, istimal korka had madla ante a tree free, o kusa halaya, in satta chere go reye e ad lag de reso an wakhad mad halaga kadi. The Habshil, how full the idea is